this company, PDX Biotech, they're the ones that came up with this Aura Strip DX, O-R-A-S-T-R-I-P-D-X, which does come in strips, um, and it's real new. And uh, so can you explain? I know veterinarians will have them where it's available. And kind of walk through, you have a cute dog, you said a black lab named Oliver. Have you tried this on Oliver? Yes, I do use it on Oliver and on my daughter's cat, Humphrey. So the way that you use it is um, that it, think of a, a pH test, except okay. this, this test has, it has a little pad. It's a nice flexible wand with a little pad on the end that changes color if thiols are present in the mouth. And it changes color from white to varying shades of yellow. And okay. so if you see yellow, there's a problem. And what yes. you will do is to gently take the strip. There you go. Excellent. Gently take the strip um, without any pressure and just swipe it along the upper outer gums from about the back big um, premolar up to where the canine is, the pointy tooth mm -hmm. in the front on each of the upper sides of the mouth. Okay. And then you wait and within 10 seconds, it will change. That's the amazing. And so any wow. degree, and sometimes the yellow can be, if you just have a few thials, sometimes the yellow can be a little hard to see. So holding it in a bright light and against a white piece of paper will really help you to be able to assess that. We are working so, on an app to help with color reading. We just don't have it quite done yet. But it's how, give us a context. How new is this? Because this in, there's, you know, greenies kind of broke way years ago. That was a big dental thing. There is a veterinary oral health council, a veterinary um, certified dentist. I mean, I, it's so nice. This is new. This is and, and because we haven't had a quick diagnostic test before, have we? At home no, or at no. the vet clinic. There was an earlier model of this test and it did not gain market traction for a variety of reasons. Nothing okay. to do with the performance performance of the test. But at that time, the interpretation of the test was cumbersome. Um, the price uh -huh. point was very high. So um, we, uh, the, the inventors of the test finally regained control of the intellectual property and patents. They own all the patents and were able to relaunch the test in about 2021, late 2021 okay. to 2022 is when they got the property back and it really launched last year. And Arden, we've sold over a million strips now worldwide. Wow. Um, they are crazy. That's crazy good. I mean, you didn't even have to be on Shark Tank to do this. But what I, I'm, I'm sorry, my background is investigative journalism. If your mother tells you she loves you, check it out. And what I'm very glad to see is that this Aura Strip DX, I don't know if that's the right way to pronounce it, but you have passed the mustard with peer review studies, you know, in the journal, the American Animal hospital association um some others very peer reviewed which means it's veterinarians analyzing does this work or not correct correct and they were actually all three of the authors on the, the different papers were are boarded veterinary dentists so yes, they really and there has been recently just in the last couple of weeks another test that came another paper that oh. came out um, that further cements the value of actual daily brushing and using Orstrip DX to monitor the results of it and what happens when you don't brush on a daily basis. So it's um, pretty exciting. You'll see more studies coming out. We've got a few up, um, in the pipeline as well, but it is peer reviewed. Um, the that file test that. has been validated and the fact that using this test helps you to determine the the presence of periodontal disease before you can see it with the naked eye is well validated in these studies. Well, and I'm talking pop pocketbook and longevity. You yeah. you might have a little more money in your wallet when you go to your vet because you're being proactive and your dog or cat may extend their life too. So there's a double Benny. Well, I'm going to add another benefit. It improves okay. the quality of the pet's life. So yeah. when I started with my pitch, I talked about Precious, which was a little yes. white toy poodle that I saw right after I opened my own hospital in 1998. And dogs have 42 teeth. Precious was missing a few. 
And I extracted 22 of them. Wow. And when her owner brought her back two weeks later, and it was because of horrible periodontal disease. When her owner brought her back two weeks later, she said, thank you. And I thought, you're thanking me for extracting 22 teeth, (laughs) right? This is a new one on me. And she said, you've given me my dog back. She's not given me kisses in over two years. And I can tell story after story after story. Our dogs can't tell us and our cats. This is a dog and cat product. You can use it in cats. I've used it in my um, daughter's cat Humphrey's mouth and he tolerates it beautifully. Um, I'm going to try it on a pet safety cat, Casey, after the show. So he's like, (laughs) okay, I'll be down in the mouth for you, Casey, for your health. He said, yes. There you go. And he said, upper outer teeth is easy. So, um, so, um, quickly though, any quick tips on how to brush a cat or dog's teeth? I know there's the finger brushes and other things. There's other companies. I don't need you. I'm not trying to make you name other places, but there seems to be options on dental care. This one's saying, hey, we got an issue here. Let's get on it, Prano. Um, tips on brushing? Yes, or strict DX as a diagnostic test. It tells you yes. there's a problem. It's not yes. curative. The test is not curative, and the test does not prevent it, okay? Yes. You you won't swipe it, and it's going to be magic and take care of the problem. Yes. So like, what I... What, so... Every puppy and kitten that came into my hospital received a dental demo and a toothbrush kit at 12 weeks of age so that we could show owners how to start brushing their teeth. Um, Oliver, my black lab, we got at age, he was three, um, and he had never had his teeth brushed. I've had other dogs that I've rehomed that have never had their teeth brushed, and I have consistently brushed my dog's teeth every day since 1988. So, wow, multiple dogs over the years, obviously not the same dog. That would be amazing, but no. Yeah. Um, right. So, um, so, so making Boston, a difference. you have yeah. to make it part of your routine. You have to leave the toothbrush on the side of your sink where you will see it. It needs Good. to be done every day. You need to use a soft toothbrush that's comfortable for the dog or cat. And you need to use a dog and cat toothpaste Please. that's designed to be swallowed. Um, once in a while, I'll mess up and I'll put my crest on the dog's toothbrush and he is not happy when I do that. No, I'll no. be like, wait, and why are you doing right? this? But he sits in the doorway and will not let me out of the bathroom until I brush his teeth because it's well, ingrained. Well, heard it here first. Uh, Dr. Winnie Hauser and Oliver and her visiting uh, nephew, Cat Humphrey, are getting uh, good dental care. We, we just have about a little time left. What's a parting message you want to give everyone? And I really hope you'll come back on the show. You have a lot of information. You're a business leader. You're a veterinarian. Uh, you saw this product and said, this is a, this is a game changer. What's your parting message, Dr. Wendy Hauser? Dental disease is so impactful for the quality of the life of the pet. And dogs and cats suffer in silence. Don't let your pet be one of them. Take ownership of your pet's mouth and manage it. And that includes routine professional cleanings under anesthesia. None of us like to anesthetize our pets, including veterinarians, and we still do it. And using or strip DX to let you know when it's time, not when it's past time. And how do they find out about it? What's the site? The site is orstripdx.com. Right now, it is a veterinary product only. Um, We do anticipate launching to the consumer channel in the next year. 